X3 adjustment instructions. Today you will learn how to adjust your X chair so that it ergonomically fits your body. Step one, height. To adjust the height of your chair, you must first raise the chair to its highest setting. While standing, face the chair and locate the paddle switches underneath the seat on your left side. Lift the frontmost switch and the chair will rise entirely. Disengage the switch, sit in the chair, and then engage the switch again. The seat will then begin to lower. Goal position, your knees should be at a perfect 90 degree angle. Step two, seat depth. Make sure that your seat depth is appropriate for your leg length. While sitting in your chair, find the paddle switch on your left side. While lifting the switch, move your hips forward or backward. The seat should slide with you. Goal. Adjust your seat to a position to leave two to three inches of space between the back of your knee and the seat, while your back rests comfortably against the backrest. Step three, dynamic variable lumbar DVL and backrest height. With your seat comfortably adjusted, it's time to adjust your dynamic variable lumbar support. This is done by adjusting the chair's backrest height to one of four backrest height settings. While sitting in the chair, Place your hands under the DVL and lift slowly. Each time you hear a click, you have changed the height setting. You can also adjust the backrest height while standing behind the X chair and lifting upwards. Goal, the perfect height for you is found when the curvature of the DVL rests in the curvature of your lower back. Step four, side float infinite recline. To utilize the side float infinite recline feature, sit in your chair and locate the paddle switch underneath the right side of the seat towards the front. Lift the paddle switch upwards and lean back. Your X chair is now in recline mode. Use the twist knob on the right side of your chair to manage the resistance of the X chair's recline. Forward for more resistance and backwards for less. To lock back upright, lean forward in the X chair and push the paddle switch down. Goal. While reclining, you want to find the perfect resistance balance. Use the twist knob to find a resistance that lets you float between upright and all the way back. Step 5. Arm Rest Arm support is an important factor to any productive workday. The X Chair's 4D armrests enable you to manipulate the armrest height as well as the depth, angle, and spacing of your arm pads. To raise or lower your armrest, locate the black button on the armrest stem. Push this in, and you can easily raise or lower the armrest's height. To adjust your arm pad positioning, simply push them forwards or backwards or towards or away from you. While holding the stem of the armrest at its point of pivot, use your free hand to push and pull the arm pad to move it left and right. Goal. Our armrests are designed to be easily adjustable so that they fit your various needs throughout the day. Keep them at a height that allows your arms to comfortably rest and adjust them to suit your preferences. Step six, headrest. If you purchased a headrest with your chair, then you can easily adjust its height by standing behind your chair and lifting up or pushing down on the headrest. Adjust its angle by pushing the headrest forward and backward. Goal, the headrest's rounded profile should fit in the nape of your neck for maximum support. Your ex-chair should now fit you like a glove.